Now is the right time for tax cuts. Um, how do we know that that must be correct? And there is suddenly a lot more money for fiscal stimulus, though. It's all this. Was it Labour's rate? The top of the charts on the uh, Conservative home. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'll keep my comment. Okay. So uh, she tweeted a photograph of the surviving prime ministers in the cenotaph on Remembrance Sunday. Yep. It's until she's 95 years old, then she'll have spent more days. And the voice came back. But he's, yes. Uh, he's actually been putting a brave face on. <laughs> He's a tantric. Louis Gonzalez told the Times on the sale of guns and human organs. Can't like about him, what is he it? He looks like a what? At a literary festival. <laughs> <laughs> and they're all like on news. What did Joe Biden celebrate this week? are trying to avoid focusing on the fact that he's now 81, mm. uh, but not his social media team, because here he is with a cake. You're wasting. Sorry. Right. Sorry. <laughs> not share the view of some French historians when it comes to Napoleon. All right, here is your equation of news, Ian and Zing. Uh, it's information. Information. Yeah. Information, information <laughs> apparently. So Let's throw a fellow scientist and lectern enthusiast. I see. Just for the science world, I think this is pretty spicy, yeah. Was too slow on the first lockdown and described him as a said, cussed out witty. Yeah. yeah. What, did, uh, what did witty say in return? of news this one is up for grabs for all of by claiming that brie was actually invented in ireland um, and that champagne was actually developed in summer